Today's video is on graph theory. So today's topic is planar graphs and non-planar graphs. And let us learn what is a planar graph and what is a non-planar graph. A graph G is called a planar graph if it can be drawn in a plane such that no two edges intersect. See here, no two edges intersect except at the vertices. Otherwise, it is a non-planar graph. See clear? A graph G is called a planar graph. If it can be drawn in a plane such that no two edges intersect. So, there is no edge crossing. If there is no edge crossing in the graph, we say that the given graph is a planar. If there is an edge crossing, then we say that the given graph is a non-planar graph. See here, let me explain you with an example. So, this is a non-planar graph. Whereas, there are four vertices that is V1, V2, V3 and V4. So, there is an edge crossing. So, these two edges cross each other and so this graph is called non-planar. And see, this can be written as, so this graph can be written as, see there are four edges that is V1, here V2, this is V3 and this is V4. So, V1 to V2. So, this is V1 to V2 and next V1 to V3 and next V3 to V4. And next one is V1 to V4. So, there is no edge crossing here. And still V3 to V1. So, th there is no edge crossing. And next what here? What is there here? The edge V2, V4. So, V2, V4. If I draw like this, there will be edge crossing. So, I am drawing like this without edge crossing. So, now this graph became planar graph. Planar graph means there shouldn't be any edge crossing. And next one, the example here is... See how many edges are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. And how many vertices are there? V1, V2, V3, V4 and V5. Total they are V1. So this is V1. This is V2. This is V3. This is V4. And this is V5. Total 5 vertices are there. And there is an edge crossing here. And here there is an edge crossing, here there is an edge crossing. And so this graph is called a non-planar graph. And now I will redraw this one without edge crossing. See here, V2 to V3. So this is V2 to V3. And next V3 to V4. So this is V2 to V4. And next one, this is V4 to V5. And next this one is V2 to V5. So there is no edge crossing. And next thing here is V2 to V4. And still there is no edge crossing. And next V1 to V4. So V1 to V4 I am drawing like this. And next one V1 to V3. So here I am drawing like this. Is there any edge crossing? So this is V1 vertex. So this graph become a planar graph. So this is a planar graph where there is no edge crossing. And this is a non-planar graph. So, this is a non-planar graph. And let me explain you with few examples here. And see, this graph is a non-planar graph. See how many vertices are there. This is V1, V2, V3 and V4. And next one, V5, V6, V7, V8. They are total 8 vertices. And so, there are edge crossings here. So, there are so many edge crossings. And so, this graph is called non-planar graph. And let me redraw this one without edge crossing. See here V1, V2, V3 and V4. And see this is V1, this is V2, this is V3 and this is again V4. And next one V5, V6, V7, V8. See I am drawing like this. This is V5, this is V6, this is V7 and this is V8. Now See here, I am showing all the connections here, V1 to V2. So, here V1 to V2. Is there any edge crossing? No. Next, V2 to V3. So, this is V2 to V3. And next one, V3 to V4. So, this is V3 to V4. And next one, V1 to V4. See, there is no edge crossing. And next one, V5 to V6. So, this is V5 to V6. And next, V6 to V7. So, this is V6 to V6. V7 and next V7 to this is V8. See here, next V8 to V5. So this is V8 to V5. And the next connection here is V1 to V5. So this is V1 to V5. And next one here is V2, V6. So this is V2, V6. And next one here is V7, V3. So this is V7, V3. 
and next thing here is v4 v8 so this is v4 v8 so this is a planar graph where there are no edge crossings so we can say that this graph is a planar and this is a non planar graph so this is a non planar graph clear you got a clear idea that wherever the two edges intersect we say that this is a non planar whereas if there is no edge crossing or crossover of edges we say that the graph is a planar graph and the next example here is this one so this is a complete bipartite graph so here a is connected with all the four vertices of the set 2 and next b is connected with all the four vertices of set 2 so this is a complete bipartite graph so here without edge crossing and let me check whether it happens or not see here they are a b c d e f and c i'm drawing this is c d e f this is a c this is d this is e and f so here i'm drawing a and here it is so here i'll show you this is b and now see here a is connected with c here also i'll connect a with c and here a is connected with d a is connected with c here a is connected with f clear and next one b is connected with c see here b is connected with c b is connected with d b is connected with e b is connected with f and the next one is a is connected to b so here a is connected to b so here there is there are no edge crossings here and so we say that this is a planar graph so this is a planar graph and this is non planar graph where two edges intersect this is a non planar graph and see here and let me give you few examples here see here k5 is a non planar graph we have to prove see how many vertices are there v1 v2 v3 v4 and v5 and we have to prove that it is non planar see how many vertices are there v1 v2 v3 and v5 and just i'm writing this is v1 so this is v2 this is v3 this is v4 and this is v5 and see i'll draw so v1 is connected to v2 v3 v4 and v5 and so i am also doing the same thing v1 is connected to v2 this is v3 this is v4 and this is v5 and next one v2 is connected to v1 next v3 so v2 is connected to v3 and again with v4 so if i draw like this there will be edge crossing and so i am drawing like this and next with v5 so v5 also i am connecting like this clear and next v3 so v3 is connected to v1 already done v3 is connected to v2 already done v3 is connected to v4 and next v3 is connected to v5 so if i draw like this there will be edge crossing if i draw like this there will be edge crossing and see if i check with v4 so v1 to v2 and next here also there will be edge crossing or else i can draw like this and next v3 to v4 to v3 and next this is v4 and see v5 v5 to v1 is there so v5 to v2 again i can draw like this v2 to v3 so clearly there will be edge crossing if i cross like this or like this so there will be an edge crossing so we say that this is a non planar graph so this is a non planar graph we can clearly say that k5 the vertices with five vertices k5 is a non planar graph and let me show you it is k33 so k33 it is a complete bipartite graph so one is connected with 4 5 6 two is connected with again 4 5 and 6 and three is connected with 4 5 and 6 this is a complete bipartite graph k33 and let me show you whether it is a uh, planar or not so this is 1 2 3 and this is 4 5 and 6 so this is 1 2 3 this is 4 5 and 6 and see here clearly one is connected to 4 one is connected to 5 and one is connected to 6 and next coming to 2 one is connected to 4 
and see I am drawing like this without edge crossing. 1 is connected to 5. So there is an edge crossing and so I am drawing like this. 1 is connected to 2 is connected to 6. Clear? Done. Next coming to 3. 3 is connected to 6. 3 is connected to 5. So I can draw like this. And 3 is connected to 4. So if I draw like this there will be edge crossing. So, there will be edge crossing here. If I draw like this, they are edge crossings here. And so, see here. There is an edge crossing. And so, we say that K33, which is a complete bipartite graph, is a non-planar. So, it is not possible for every graph to draw it as a planar graph. And there are few graphs, few examples which are non-planar. Which are non-planar and we can't redraw without edge crossings or crossover of edges so here this is k5 is a non-planar graph completely and this is a complete bipartite graph and this is also non-planar we can't redraw this one thank you so much for watching and hope you guys understand what is a planar graph and what is non-planar graph in my next video i'll be uh, covering about the topics coloring and covering and so please watch them and please if you really like please take time to raise your thumb pass it on to your friends and subscribe to this channel thank you so much